God. My messes don't need excuses anymore. How? How? Oh, God. All right. Let, let's. Oh, my God. She was so adorable. Look at her beautiful. Subscribe, please! Alright, hello guys. There's actually been like some Cheska trailers recently that have been like kinda 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 lazy about. I don't wanna say lazy, but I've been certainly late about it. We are gonna get the update very, very soon. So I kinda wanna check those uh those trailers, right? Um so we have we have a character teaser here for her, but we also have the collected miscellany that did come out. So I think we're going to be enjoying both. So let's start with this one. Let's have a look, Zs. Chaska, love and peace. I'm still upset about the sister, by the way. Yasha, the Inca gang called dibs on this job. Oh, if he had dibs, then he has here, which is what he is. Not in my book. Oh, damn. Yasha. Back down, or you're not gonna like how this ends. <gasps> we had an understanding, but taking you out sounds like a better deal. Boss, now's our chance. Let's get him. We'll show you. Yeah, let's go. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. Huh? Kokosaur? She's here. Oh, she ain't got no time. Do me a favor before this gets ugly. Let's talk this out, shall we? Jaska, this will end in blood. There's nothing you can do to stop it. Enough talking. Let's fight. <laughs> her boy's so cool, by the way. One. Like her signature weapon. Looks to me like you put aside your differences without me. Jaska, we came to spill blood, and that blood is yours. With you out of the way, we won't have to watch our backs. How's that for peacemaking? Damn. Here's a little gift from the Inca and Yasha gangs. <sighs> what a mess. Little late for regrets. I said no regret. You misunderstand me. <gasps> Dealing with you? That's the easy part. <laughs> Dude, she doesn't give a crap. Another fight? You're still oh. injured. Safety first. How many times Bruh. do I have to tell you? They were hardened criminals. They can't be reasoned with. <sighs> so I had to. No! <laughs> I almost forgot. My messes don't need excuses anymore. Mm, I hate this. Oh, God. I'm so depressed about this whole thing. I'm so upset. Oh, my God. <sighs> my messes don't need excuses anymore. How? How? Oh, God. All right. Let, let's. Oh, my God. She was so adorable. Look at her little button face. I hate it here. I hate it. Here. Let's just look at something that's gonna make me less impressed. <laughs> let's just let, let's move on. Let's look like oh there we go. Reins of flight in hand. That pug, 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 pug. That's what we want. Okay. Suspended high above the ground. A tribe of lofty ideals and personalities. Okay. It's probably like yeah. Poi sold the issues with the VA, so it's in Japanese here. Man, she's so cool. Her gun is so funny. Soul Sniper and Soars into the Air. Man, the mobility she has is crazy. But like, I don't know, man, it's hard. I feel like I should skip her and just get my Vuika and her weapon when she comes out, but... I mean, there's something about her that gets me, you know? Look at how far she can go, it's crazy. 
元素スキルを再発動すると終了する Her weapon looks so good. Oh my god. A normal attack deals AoE the end more damage. Totally missing from her. So she does have a little bit of uh, AoE. It's not a lot, but here we can see there's a bit of AoE with the bullets, I guess. But it's very small. A number of enemies within range. The longer you charge, the more bullets you have. You can have up to six. It all deals AoE damage. For every pyro I drew, carry electro characters in the party. Uh, essentially, she gets a chance to get a, a special bullet. Of the three shells can be converted. Shadow Fan shells are fired in a last in, first out order. So, like, if the last bullet is fired, it will be the first one to go in. If there are party members who meet their limited conversation requirements, such chance to just get third loaded shadow shell will be converted to one of the quest of the time. So essentially the way it works is that the two first are always gonna be any more. But then the third one has a chance to be any of the one of the other one. No, the third one will always be converted. And then the last three will be random with the other elements, right? I think that's how it works. Yeah, there's a chance it's converted. Mm, okay. I don't know. She's like a. She's like a DPS, right? The thing is that I kind of like her design and I love her bow, but I feel like it's probably not worth pulling just for that. Because, like, the gameplay itself, I, I don't mind the gun, but it's just like, I'm not sure I'll be super into the gameplay itself. So, I don't know. In then to cover, when a party member triggers a night soul burst, she has to fire a burning shadow sh on shot in the nearby enemy dealing animal damage. Oh, so she has a little bit of off field damage, I guess. Which is nice, because that means instant swirl, right? We'll be covered to one corresponding element. Oh, it's considered charge attack. Okay, never mind. So it's not swirl. I think I can probably gain set amount of float just on the 15 enemies. Oh, that's cool. Can't be trigger in domains. Yeah, that's for the overworld. Like, she's gotta be like an overworld queen. Oh, you can switch from the... That's so useful. So she can actually... You can be with your glider and you can switch into her and she will instantly fly. That's so cool. It's like the same when you do like climbing, but it's even fucking better because like you can't do that with other characters. You can't switch out when you're gliding. Man, I'm hesitating way too much. I don't know. That bow is so pretty. And she's gonna be pretty good with like, uh, like, electro. I feel like her plus like facial or own, and then. I don't know. Probably book and a book and like uh, Bennett. Yeah, I think like a good team for us could probably gonna be like uh, Bennett. Um, and then I feel like Oron might be better because of the AoE. Like, I feel like the thing is that Fischl is full single target, right? Oron has some AoE, a bit of taunt too, and he buffs like Electro Charge. So Oron might be better than for this team specifically. So you could have Farina, Oron, and Bennett maybe, or, you know, like, a, you know, like whatever. And with her, like she works better in full rainbow teams, right? As in everyone has a different element type. So I think that could be very good. 
I think that's a team that's going to be pretty good. I don't think she's going to be, like, super, super strong. Like, as strong as characters like, you know, Olokino, Nouvellette, and stuff. Like, even Moalani and stuff. But she's probably going to be on par with characters like, you know, maybe Hu Tao, Clan, characters like that, you know? And I'm just like, I don't know. I, I wish I liked... Like, while I kind of enjoy her design and, like, even the gun, I think, is funny... I'm not super, like, super mega excited about the gameplay itself. Like, flying in the sky and doing charge attack and doing, like, pew 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 with some, like, random elements. Uh, I don't know. I, I think it's one of the cases where I'm going to have to to try her out. I'll probably do a trial and see if I can vibe with that gameplay. Because uh, for now, it doesn't look super exciting. Um, and to, to give context, I don't like the gameplay of New Blade either, for example. Just like he charge his attack and then he goes Kamehameha. It's not really for me. So I'm going to definitely try her out a lot in the trial and, and see if I can get around to her. And um, if if I don't, I'm probably just going to skip her and get my VUI cap, right? But if I if I like her, maybe I'll consider just getting her on a rerun or something. I'm not sure. Let me know what you guys think regarding her. Are you going to be pulling for her? Do you like her? Burb! Oh, look at the baby burb! So cute! The Man, Chaska, I will say, this thing is like, Chaska is so cool, her story is so emotional and stylish, but awesome. Like, I wish the gameplay was, like, vibing with me more. Like, the gameplay doesn't excite me that much. That's the only problem I have with her. It's like, everything else is good, but I want to pull for a character I'm not going to like using, you know what I mean? I think that is, like, one of the most important part. So, yeah, I don't know, dude. I'll maybe when I get my hands on her, I'll be like, okay, never mind. This is awesome. I take everything I said back. But uh, yeah, anyway, I'm still a little bit of on the fence. That's pretty much it. Anyway, I'm looking forward to seeing her. I'm looking forward to seeing her tribe, her companion quest. And maybe that will make me change my mind. Who knows? Anyway, that's going to be it for me here. And uh, I'll catch you on the next one. We're going to be having a look at um, other characters coming in soon. So yeah, cheers. Bye-bye.